what's going on guys Brian here coming to another video today what I have for you is some MR6 gameplay using that epic haptic camo for whatever reason they changed it it was a rare and I was getting a million and one of them like I have so many guns with haptic on it now but now that they changed it to epic I imagine it'll be one of those camos that you don't get nearly as often and maybe that's the reason why they changed it is because it is a sick ass camo and everybody loves it so they decided to make it epic I have no idea I just recall that it was rare and then when I went to put it on one of my guns in zombies the other night it's now considered an epic you decide why they changed it because I have no clue this is kind of going to be a chill commentary, I'm just going to talk about some random shit that's on my mind, and it'll be quick as well, so I hope you guys enjoy the gameplay, because that's mostly what it's going to be all about in this one. Don't really have too much news or anything new to talk about. I'm really surprised that we don't have more info on Infinite Warfare. That was one thing that I was thinking about the other night, because T. Martin put out a video about a couple new things that was seen in a live stream they did on Facebook last night and by this time last year we knew so much about Black Ops 3 and that's normally the way it is each year is around this time we already know a shit ton about the game in multiplayer and that is the big secret is we have no idea what's going on with multiplayer aside from the movement is going to feel a lot like Black Ops 3 and they are putting in more weapons than we have ever seen in any Call of Duty which is crazy because Advanced Warfare, I almost said Infinite Warfare right there, Advanced Warfare had like over 350 variants I believe, it was something along them lines, it was a lot. So that shows you right there that there is going to be an insane amount of guns. I almost said obscene. I'm keeping this in here because I was just thinking about this too that's really funny is I think it'd be funny to make a video where I don't cut it at all and when I screw up on the takes I just leave it in there to show you guys that sometimes I have to restart something that I've said numerous times because I either step over my words and jumble them together or something along them lines goes wrong when you're trying to make a commentary and it's funny I guess it'd be considered bloopers but I don't have like a recording system to where it just records and it's all recorded like you know how people do vlogs and they can have outtakes well with this it's not like that you just hit circle and it'll cut everything that you just said maybe I'll try it one of these days you guys let me know for those of you that watch the video, let me know if you think that would be something that would be humorous in your opinion. I think it'd be kind of funny because it doesn't happen every single time, but there is a lot of videos where I have to hit the freaking circle button, like right there, I almost fucked up, and start all over again. But I just got the jump shot last kill right there, so we're coming up at the end of this video. I know it was a short one, and the commentary was complete nonsense but i hope you guys enjoyed regardless if you did don't forget to leave a like subscribe if you're new and as always guys i will see you in the next one you weren't the bunch of scrubs i was told to expect